Good morning, everybody. Happy, happy day. <laughs> Caitlin slept over last night. We went to the beach yesterday and we went in the pool and we went on the boat. Like, we were just, we had ourselves a day. We did. And it was such a good day. And then we literally went to bed at like, we got in bed at 10 o'clock because we were so tired. Like, just being in the sun all day kind of drains you. And so then we went to bed and we had plans to wake up early this morning, go to spin and then shower and then go to brunch. Yeah, well, we both did woke up. Happen. No, it did not. And I'm so happy that you were feeling the same thing as yeah. me. I guess we both just needed sleep really badly. So we just canceled our class really quickly on our phones with like one eye half open. Went back to sleep. <laughs> Went back to sleep. Then we slept too long because we had brunch reservations yeah. at 1230 and really had to get ready fast. That's why this is the first vlog clip of the day, but we both need a big fat coffee. <laughs> Real bad. <laughs> like we're both like, uh, like driving. But yeah, so we have brunch plans with our friend Sophia at Oxford Exchange. The best place on the planet. So many of you guys will like tweet me or send me Instagram DMs of you going to Oxford when you come to Tampa and it just makes my day because it really is a beautiful place. It'll just be a, I think today's gonna be a good day, a good vlog, all that fun stuff. Let's get it started. Yay. Let's get caffeinated. <laughs> place in the entire world upstairs Nordstrom I'm so happy I haven't been in so long would you say I'm gonna hate this vlog <laughs> just cuz I'm so awkward no you're the best <laughs> guys if you live in Tampa or you come to Tampa you have to come to International Mall it's my favorite we're gonna go to Bare Minerals and Zara a good time I don't know if it's just my Zara right now but guys I'm finding so many cute things for the summer Guys, Caitlin and I are just having ourselves a day. Oh Sophia God, just left. Like, who are you talking to? <laughs> I've got some stuff at Sephora. I'll do a haul when I get home. Finally back home. I'm drinking some green tea. Oh, Freddie is jamming. He's about to head to his um, athletic banquet at school. I was supposed to go, but he was like, you don't really need to come, and I'm exhausted from the day. Freddie, can I show you off? You look so good. Oh, shoot. <laughs> Oh, and there she is. Just got her hair done. Oh, hey, Dad. Hi, sweetie. Hi, girls. <laughs> there they go, my cute fam. Bye, guys. I'll be chilling. I'll lock the door. I want to show you guys what I got at the mall today. I got a good amount. I haven't gone to the mall in a while where I just like buy a ton of stuff. Not a ton of stuff, but like I get a good amount of things. I've been doing a lot of online shopping. And someone commented like, I miss when hauls would literally be like you go to the mall and you go to like a few different stores and show like a haul rather than like from one store which I'm obviously still gonna do like I'm about to do like a big princess poly haul and stuff like that but I do kind of miss like mall hauls you know it's just not as common so this is gonna be a little mall haul I also got stuff, some stuff in the mail from Amazon and Forever 21 so I'll unbox those but first I want to show you guys what I got at Zara, Sephora, and Urban Outfitters Guys, Zara had really cute stuff today. Like, I was really impressed. Like, it's either hit or miss. And they had, I literally, everything I got is blue and white for some reason. Um, I got a lot of stuff just for, like, the summer. And specifically going to Greece in a couple weeks with Brooke. So, I wanted to, like, prepare for that. And it's kind of funny because the Greece flag, I believe, is blue and white. And I got all blue and white stuff. So, all right. First off, this is, like, one of my favorite tops. I think I vlogged it. It's Sorry, this is not going to be a try-on. I'm honestly exhausted. And since Caitlin slept over last night, I didn't want to, like, be annoying and edit my vlog with her. So, even though she's super cool, I was just honestly tired since we went to bed so early. So, I still have to, like, edit yesterday's vlog and get it up. So, Sorry, there's just no try on today. I apologize, but I'll be posting a lot of photos and vlogging with all these clothes. Anyways, this is the first top. It was $39. I got a size small at Zara. So cute, so flattering on. It's just this fun tank top. I just love the low cut, the V cut, whatever you want to call it. So cute. And then I got two of the same shirt in different colors. The first one's this white one. I think I also vlogged it. Uh, when I was trying it on at Zara, I just love the detailing. It's just super like ruched and you don't need to like wear anything under it Which is awesome and convenient. Um, and then I also got it in blue because I love this blue Zara has a lot of clothing in this like fabric with this blue color Maybe I should put the exposure down a little bit. Um, 
I just love this top. It's very like thick and it's just, I don't know, it just, it's flattering. Also, another top I got is this one. It's just uh, off the shoulder, but also with a halter. Long sleeve, white flowy top. This is just perfect, I feel like, for like dinner or just like going to the beach just to wear over my bathing suit. I just love shirts like this, and especially, I wasn't gonna get it, and then I was like, oh, it's halter. And Caitlin was like laughing at me. She's like, oh, but it's halter, you have to get it. I was like, yeah. I got another white tank, surprise, and it's this one. It's like a low-key peplum top, but it was also just really flattering. It's kind of similar to the other one. I just really needed more like white, simple summer tops, so this one was perfect. I got two pairs of shorts. The first one, these are so cute on, very flattering, and they're just comfortable, um, are these. I love how they're cuffed and then they tie at the top and they're kind of like paper bag style. I love anything paper bag. They're just super flattering for your legs in particular. So yeah, and it just has one pocket in the back, horses in the back. Yeah, I couldn't not say that. The other pair of shorts I got are these white ones. They're kind of like chino material-ish. Eh, no, not chino. They're white, kind of paper bag style too, and they also tie. These are just perfect summer shorts. They were also really flattering. They kind of go out on the bottom, so they're very flattering to your legs. They don't stick to your thighs. I just, I don't do shorts that stick to my thighs. It's just, it's just not for me. I always have trouble with um, denim skirts because I have a bigger bottom but like a smaller waist. So I always have to wear a belt, which is annoying. So I tried on this denim skirt just to try it out. I got it in a size medium and it fits around my waist and my bottom, which is perfect without having to wear a belt. Because sometimes you don't want to be flashy and like wear a belt. So this is perfect. It's super flattering. Um, I think I got some vlog clips in it as well. I'm really trying not to buy any more shoes because I have too many shoes and I just shouldn't. But these are shoes I've been looking for forever. A ton of girls at UGA have these shoes and I have just always wanted a pair because they're super cute, super flattering. These guys, these are so cute, perfect for the summer. I mean, I really couldn't not get them. They were $70, which is a lot, but Zara always has the best shoe selection and these seem like pretty good quality. I tried them on, they're really comfortable. I just, I love this material and it's just gonna be so cute. Like I might even bring these to Greece. I have to walk around and make sure they're walkable, but I just feel like these are a great summer shoe. From Urban Outfitters, I got two things. Um, I got this game for when my friends come next week. It's called For the Girls. It's kind of like a what do you mean, you know, one of those games. Um, but it says perfect for bachelorette parties, girls night out, girls night in, birthday parties, sororities, pre-games, reunions, and more. I just feel like this one's going to be funny because it's got like a ton of different types of cards. So it has like a never have I ever section, best of the best, rapid fire, most likely to, and truth or dare. And then I was just going to get that at Urban, but I'm really into just basics as always. And I saw this really cute, just basic creamy white top. I got it in size medium. And I don't know, I just think this will be really cute with just some boyfriend jeans and sneakers. From Sephora, I was in a spending mood today. Do you guys ever do this? Either you go to the mall and you're just like, eh, like I'm not really in the mood, or you're just like in the mood. That was me today. So I went to Sephora because I had to get a refill of something, and then I just got a couple other things. I had over 2,000 points. I also found out I'm Sephora Rouge, which means that I just go there too much. Uh, I found that out today. I was like, oh my gosh. I used 500 points today and I got the Caudalie French Natural Favorites. I love this skincare brand. It comes with an essence, which I've never tried an essence before. Um, an eye cream, a radiant serum, and a hydrating sorbet. They also gave me this. They're doing um, facials right now, so I might go and do a facial. Then I got three products that I want to show you guys. The first one I got is just a refill of the It Cosmetics CC Cream. I'm obsessed with it. I wear it every day. I got it in the shade medium because that's what I'm using right now and hopefully I'll just keep getting tanner and I'm hoping that by the time at the end of the summer I'm gonna need to go get the darker shade. They just started carrying Charlotte Tilbury at the Sephora um, and I wanted to try out one of their products just because I've heard such good things. So I'm trying out the Airbrush Flawless Finish Skin Perfecting Micro Powder. Um, I use the Hourglass Dim Light Ambient Powder to set but sometimes it's almost too glowy and too much so I'm gonna try this it's just such a beautiful packaging and I don't know I've heard good things about this brand so I just thought it'd be a good thing to try out and I just needed like a new setting powder last but not least from Sephora I got this this is the hourglass ambient lighting palette because I was gonna get a refill of my dim light powder but then I was like ooh, I kind of want to try one of the other shades and this one has three different so I kind of plan it's basically like a perfecting powder so you put it on after you do your foundation and whatever so I'm just gonna take my brush and kind of go through all three and just see what that truck looks like now this part's gonna be unboxing I got a couple things from Amazon so we'll see what's what oh yay I got another Eno hammock if you guys watched like yesterday the day before two days ago I vlogged 
and I was on the hammock. We have an Eno hammock out back on our gazebo, and we used to have two, but one of them broke because we just always have people sitting on them. Like, my friends will come over and like five of them sit on it, and then it just breaks. So, I bought a new one. I bought a double nester. These are awesome. You can put them on trees. Like, I used to go to like parks and just be campy and like do that. I haven't done that in a while, but um, since a ton of my friends are coming, I wanted to make sure we had two hammocks out there. So, I bought one. I invested one for the fam. And I got green and yellow because I just thought it would like go with our backyard. It would go with our backyard. I have been in a country cowboy vibe, western vibe. I don't know what it is. But I really wanted like a cute cowboy, cowgirl hat to wear to the beach and just by the pool. Because I'm really not trying to like get any more sun on my face. And sometimes I feel really obnoxious and like too bougie with like floppy hats. And I just really wanted to be cute and wear like a bikini and like a cowgirl hat. So I got this one off Amazon. I mean, nothing crazy. Um, but it just looks like this. And I liked how it had this little turquoise bead here. Yeah, this is cute. I just, I don't know what came over me. I'll have to shape it, obviously, because it's in like this bag. But, um, or I could wear it with the, the this. I don't know. You guys might think I'm crazy, but I just thought this would be really cute when I'm on the boat and stuff, you know, just summer vibes all right this package i'm excited about um if you guys watched my vlog a couple days ago i bought a ton of bathing suits on forever 21 because they were doing buy one get one half off and their bathing suits are already like 11 bucks each so i was really excited okay i'm really lazy to go get scissors so let's see if i can do this Ooh. this is the top i wanted some neon stuff um and it's just like a simple one i really like to get bathing suits that aren't going to give me crazy tan lines for the most part i love this it's just simple kind of more sporty and then here are the bottoms these are i think this is from their like oh upf 50 awesome it's not neon green it's literally yellow it's like a bright yellow and again here are the bottoms it's the exact same set just in a different color and I got a striped set. Um, I liked the pastel colors. I like being comfortable in my bathing suits. I don't buy a lot of skimpy ones. They're really cute. I just, I really like to feel comfortable in my own skin. If I don't feel comfortable in my bathing suit, like, forget about it. And I know I'm just going to be, like, walking around all day and just, like, on the boat and stuff. And you just want to feel good. Oh, and then the one clothing item I got is this. I got these long beach pants because I've been wanting a pair like this for a while. A lot of people wore them at, like, Coachella and everything. Um, and they're just sheer, so they're, like lace kind of i hope these look good on me it was definitely a gamble they weren't that expensive they were 22 dollars and it'd be really cute to wear like a black bathing suit bottom with this underneath or like a neon bathing suit bottom underneath like with your bikini top i just that was the vibe i was going for and then i got this bikini top that um has like thicker straps with bows on top and it's just like kind of similar to the other one and then the bottoms also have bows. Sorry, I'm just getting lazy. And then this top is my one kind of funky tan line potential top. But I thought this would look really cute with those black pants and some black bottoms. I thought I got sent the wrong top, but it's just not. So it's a halter. So it like looks like this on, obviously. Or how to? Uh, I don't think you'll be able to tell what it looks like till I like actually put it on. But you guys get the idea. It's like a halter bikini top, and it's like twisty, and it's really really cute. So yeah, that is everything I got. Literally, look at this now. It's just a little crazy town on my ground. On my ground. I think I'm just gonna chill for the rest of the night because I'm exhausted, and I'm going to spin in the morning. Tomorrow I'm not vlogging because I have a video going up tomorrow instead about how to kind of have a healthy lifestyle and how I'm trying to have a healthy summer and just talking about my tips. So that'll be up tomorrow, so I hope you guys enjoy. But I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I'm gonna end it here, so I've got lots of editing to do and this haul was a good time. I love you guys so much. Thanks so much for watching. I hope you guys are enjoying these daily uploads and I'll see you very soon for my next video. Bye!